everyone, my name is Miranda and it is exciting, exciting news because the season two first trailer of Shadowhunters was released at New York Comic Con and I'm so excited for this. They started filming a little while ago and I was like so anxious to see anything that I could about this series because season two, it's been off the air now, Shadowhunters, for a while and season two isn't premiering till January 2nd which is going to be about a full year since Shadowhunters first premiered. So it's a long wait and it's been a long wait so I'm anxious to get any kind of look I can at it and I did not think we were going to get a trailer at New York Comic Con. It just didn't enter my mind even though I think last year is about the time when we first started seeing the trailer of Shadowhunters and stuff so I'm real excited because I didn't know how much I was going to fall in love with the show. It's so awesome, so incredible. The actors are so great. The characters are really amazing and I even like it better than the books, I will say. So without further ado, let's check out this trailer. You don't have to protect me anymore. Whoa. Ooh, I even like the look. Look at that. Like, it's so much darker now. It looks super intense. I have to say, I know season two is going to be somewhat based on City of Ashes, right? That's book two. I'm not, I'm not up to date with this series. I should know it, but it's going to be based on book two, so that's why we saw the scenes of them on the boat and stuff like that, because that's a pivotal scene in book two. So I'm excited that they're including that, because that scene of them jumping off the boat was so so cool. I don't know if like their budget got raised but the special effects look a bit better than they did I have to say in at least the pilot and the first couple episodes. I have to say after that I think they found a better balance of like not making things look so CGI so like I guess it probably saved them money but then it also made it look more realistic and less like phony but it's just really cool. I'm interested I think to see how the season's gonna go now that Jace is kind of separated from all of them because I think what made the show so cool for me was the dynamic between all of them so now that you're missing part of that dynamic I, I do wonder how it's going to present itself and how it's going to like seem with Jace being missing and kind of on his own and everything but I think Jace and Dom could carry a storyline by themselves. Dom's a really good actor and I think there's a lot of material you could pull for Jace to try and give him his own storyline and his own finesse. Really excited to see Clary in the season because she just looked like she's so coming into her own. I mean they said season one of Shadowhunters was only 19 days so obviously she's in a very different place than she was at the start of season one. I mean that shot of her walking in when she's like bloody and looking like just like shell-shocked and pissed off at the same time was really really amazing and I like how we kind of have this conflict with her mom because it was in the book but I feel like it wasn't in the book it was more like oh you're just telling me Jace is a bad guy and I'm gonna be a moody teenager and not listen to you whereas in this it looks like her mom is still keeping stuff from her and she's like what what are you doing mom so I like that there's gonna be this un this untrusting I guess between her and her mom because she's trying to say that Jace can't be trusted that Jace is a villain and evil and Clary is thinking like no he's the one that saved me he's the one that opened my eyes to this world that you've tried to keep me from this whole time and help me save you so if you're saying he's the bad guy like what does that make you then so I'm really really intrigued to see this the scene of Clace when he's like I'm tired of your mind games that was really good. I feel like the actors are just so good on the show, which makes it amazing. Like, they're, it, it's just really good. And I've already seen theories saying, like, that's the part in the book where basically he's being manipulated kind of to see things that aren't real. So he might have seen Clary previously, but it wasn't really Clary. So now when he sees the real Clary, he thinks it's not her so he's kind of like don't do this to me again and it's really her but I'm super excited I don't know like obviously they haven't filmed the whole season I'm pretty sure so that boat scene can't be the finale so what's gonna be our big finale that's what I'm really interested in but that just looked really really cool and I'm really really excited for the premiere now January 2nd still pretty far away but hopefully we'll get some more looks 
before then and just, I don't know, I'm really, really excited, guys. I really like this show. I know a lot of people don't, but I'm really, I really, really like it. That's all I can say. And I just, I'm like, oh, but it looks so, so good. So if you've seen the trailer, please feel free to leave your thoughts about it down below, your favorite parts, what you're anticipating for to happen in season two and all that. And also make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and subscribe to my channel down below to be told to make all sorts of new videos. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.